Well, no, no, commiserations. At half time, you were in it, but first 15 minutes of the second half cost you, didn't it? Definitely, definitely. I think uh, the first half is is the way we wanted. We wanted to play. Um, we were organized. We sustained. We controlled Tottenham. Very difficult. Very difficult. Unfortunately, the way we can see their own goal, um, but the reaction was positive. Was good. We went. We score. Um, we play good. We play good. Um, we have a chance. There's another incident in the in the first half that can change the history of the game. Um, I mentioned I mentioned the red card. I think it's clear. I saw it. Unfortunately, that the VAR didn't see the same way. Is this Madison on Ryan yeah, Yates? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's clear. It's clear. Um, it's over. Okay, it's over. Finished. But these things that we want better decisions, and then the missed chance that we have that can change everything. It's it's a good one to to go in the half time with the with the advantage. It didn't happen, even though I think uh, the first half was good and we wanted to go again, but we didn't. We allowed Tottenham to score. We were passive. We should have reduced the distance, um, and then our our tasks became much harder, much harder. Yeah, once they've gone three one, that yeah. makes it a, a very difficult task from that point yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, yeah, because they have good possession of the ball and always the threat of the of the space with the speed and the, the pace that they have with their with their players. Um, but we try, we try till the end, knew, knowing that we we had a missed chance today. Uh, we had a missed chance today, but um, positives. The first half, let's try to to again go and try in ninety minutes. You mentioned that missed chance. I mean, it's it's sad, really, that it, it fell to Chris Wood, who's been in such great goal-scoring form. He'd already got you one today. Uh, I'm sure he was gutted about missing that second one. Definitely, of course. <laughs> of course, but he played very well. He scored a beautiful goal in a, in a beautiful moment that that we made, the movement of Nico and Anthony, um, and then the chance. But uh, to have to miss the chance, you have to be there. And Chris is being huge for us, huge for us. And uh, we go again, we go again. Yes, we mentioned after Tuesday and you, you pointed out that it was right on Tuesday not to get too high after the win. I guess the same maybe after the defeat is not to get too low, but on to the next one. Definitely, definitely. This is our, our spirit and this is how we, we have to stick till the end and focus on the next one. Have a nice analysis of what happened today because two different halves try to understand what happened. And um, But like you said, when we win, we cannot go over the moon because it's a hard task ahead of us. We know we lost, regroup, be together and fight and fight because we need points. The start of the second half, how much did that disappoint you? You mentioned there about being passive and maybe not closing down yeah. quickly enough. That, Given the way you played and ended the yeah. first half, that must have been really disappointing. And surprising, it? surprising, because that was not uh, the mentality on the dressing room. We wanted to go, we wanted to try. Uh, we knew that Tottenham was going to react in the first minutes of the second half. It was about sustaining, calming down, having good possession and go for the game. Um, that's what we told, but not uh, every time is possible. Can I just ask you about Morgan Gibbs-White? It looked like he took a knock and then obviously had to, you, you took yeah. him off. Is he OK? Let's, let's, assess, let's assess Morgan and, and all the players. Uh, we need all of them. Absolutely. Thanks for your time.